Just believe me, since you've now heard for yourself that Hamlet was the one to kill your father and is now attempting to kill me. So it seems, but tell me, why didn't you do anything about it? There are two reasons. One, his mother is faithful to him and I could not act without considering her. And two, the people love him and so I would be at fault if anything happened to him. And so I have lost my great father and have had my sister driven to desperate times. I will get revenge. Do not worry. We must not fret. I will explain more later. What's the news? Letters from Hamlet to the queen. From Hamlet? Who brought them? Sailors. But the letters were given to me by Claudio. Laertes, you can hear what they have to say. You can leave now. Dear Queen, you know that I have nothing left in this kingdom. Tomorrow can I meet with you? I want to ask for forgiveness and explain why I've returned. What does this mean? Is this a joke? Do you know who wrote it? This is Hamlet's writing. He says he is bankrupt and alone. Do you know what he means? I do not know, but let him return. I want to say to his face, Die, you fool. Okay, Laertes, but can I guide you? Of course, and you won't stop me from having vengeance. Fine by me. If he returns, we will set a trap for him, and no one will know because it will look like an accident. King, make the plans and let me carry them out. This sounds good. You are highly spoken of, and Hamlet has heard your travels. He's envious of not only you, but your entire person. If we had the nation's best fencers, Hamlet would come to fight you. What of this? Laertes, was your father dear to you, or are you putting on a sad face? Why do you ask this? Not that I think you didn't love your father, but Hamlet will come. And how will you prove you are your father's son? Which action will you take? I'll cut his throat in church. But Laertes, if you do this, stay in your home. We will make everyone brag about you, and the Frenchman will set up a match between you and Hamlet. Being careless, he will not see it coming. I will do it, and to make extra sure, I will put poison on my sword, so deadly that even a scratch will kill him. Let's think about this more. If this should fail, we need a backup plan. Right, I have it. I'll have a cup with your poison ready. That will get him. Wait, I hear something. One great sorrow after another. Your sister has drowned, Larites. Drowned? Where? There is a willow tree that hangs over the brook that has leaves which make great garlands. She climbed on the branch to get these leaves, and the branch broke. She fell, and her clothes spread wide, which held her float for a minute. Her clothes soaked up the water and pulled her under to a muddy death. Too much sorrow has had you, poor Ophelia, so I will forbid my tears. Goodbye, king. I would be fired up, but these tears have extinguished it. Let's follow him. I had to work to calm his rage, but I fear this will make it worse.